it is a general reading this may or may not resonate okay if it doesn't check out your other placements if you need a personal reading all that information is going to be below hi pisces what's good this is going to be a general love reading for my lovely fishes okay my baby sharks what's going on hope everyone's hope and safe don't get out this is a general reading so it may or may not resonate with every pisces watching this video like i always say feel free to switch the energies and take what resonates and leave the rest just to put it out there sometimes i say bad words if it offends you hard left off the channel but i hope you stay all right one more shuffle okay let's do this coming into the current situation we have the magician virgo aries gemini energy for me could be pisces what's influencing the magician is the five of pentacles someone's left out in the cold what happened in the past the two of wands in the reverse What's on your mind, Pisces, is the chariot. Why is all this happening? The reason for the reading is the Knight of Swords. What will Pisces experience in the near future is temperance. All right, and the overall energy is the King of Wands in reverse. Someone's not taking action. Okay, this is someone being inconsistent, could be a player. Could be someone married, could be cheating. We'll see. <clears throat> All right, let's clarify. Let me just have a look. So, yes. Um, in the past, there was a decision that was made. We have the two of wands in reverse, okay? Maybe someone uh, chose to stay on a, make a safer decision or someone just chose a decision that... Um, was more convenient to them I, I always feel the two of wands in reverse is it could still be a little indecisive but could also be a decision that was made okay any of it i feel this is sometimes making the safer choice okay not going and exploring out the unknown right now you're manifesting okay we have the magician here you're manifesting something why because we have the five of pentacles you're separated from someone someone's someone left you out in the cold you abandoned someone someone abandoned you separation breakup no communication whatever on your mind you want to move forward okay you have the chariot here the chariot you could be dealing with the cancer the chariot is someone who's very focused very determined you know like they know what they want and they're not going to let anyone or anything stop them okay this is moving forward like razor sharp focus okay you could be wanting to travel towards someone or someone would be wanting to travel towards you all this is happening because someone's rushing in with communication okay you could be dealing with an air sign aquarius libra gemini this is someone who's a younger air sign and someone who's rushing in to communicate okay whoever's coming in to communicate this could be an opportunity that you have been waiting for or someone could have been waiting for an opportunity to com communicate with you but there's someone who's rushing in however you're going to have a lot of patience you know you have the temperance here could be dealing with a, a sagittarius this is compromising cooperating okay so you and the other person both of y'all are going to know where you're at you're going to be at a much better place and um i think because that's all only because you're manifesting you're you're can manifesting you have the power the magician is someone who's got the gift of the gab okay this is someone who knows exactly what they want and they they know they have everything that they need to make things work out okay i mean the magician can be a little manipulative but this is you know the magician upright is a little manipulative but manipulative in a way which is not harming anyone else okay it's not like very self-serving energy which it would have been in the reverse anyways all right let's start clarifying this badass reading all right, Pisces, why is the King of Wands in reverse as the overall energy for Pisces, please? Why is the King of Wands in reverse the overall energy for Pisces, please? Okay, someone cut someone out. We have the King of Swords. The King of Swords deals with truth, clarity. He deals with his logic, mind and reasoning. So maybe someone was inconsistent and the King of Swords came in and said, you know what, I think I'm done. Bye-bye. 
there was some cutthroat communication could be and someone cut someone out for sure okay if it's all it's all because the king of wands in reverse this is someone who's non-committal too okay this is someone who's very inconsistent like i said clarify the king of swords clarify the king of swords could be dealing with an air sign of Chris libra gemini clarify the king of swords please yep and now someone wants to return back either someone was caught cheating lying or this is someone who wants to return back after ignoring or avoiding a connection all right whoever this person was right they were being inconsistent they could have been trying to avoid something or ignore something and so they got cut off and now they want to return back someone's coming back after understanding that what they did was wrong and now they want to turn into a new leaf okay for the good they want to change for the better clarify for the seven of swords in reverse clarify for the seven of swords in reverse please the sign of swords in reverse. Clap <coughs> the seven of swords in reverse, please. All right, but whoever is returning to you, either you're shut off emotionally or they're shut off. Okay, we have the king of cups in reverse. This is so now we have three people here. I mean, that's just funny, it doesn't have to be, but so you have the king of war. We have kings here, so we're not, no one's. We're not messing with anyone who's a knight. You're not messing with anyone young. You're messing with like big people here. Okay, these are these are mature people. These are all kings. You have the king of wands here. You have the king of swords. We have the king of cups. We're only missing the king of pentacles. I'm sure they'll say hi. But uh, yeah, whoever's returning to you, right? They're emotionally shut off. Or now that they're returning to you after feeling guilty about avoiding something, but you're shut off. You're like, you know what? Fuck you. No, I don't need you. The king of, you know what I feel? king of wands in reverse is returning back after feeling guilty about something because the king of wands in reverse is someone who's non-committal they're inconsistent they don't take action they're laid back stuff like that you know like they they're, they're usually the executionists you know but this is someone who's just not executing they're just laid back like no nah, i'm not doing that like I, I don't want anything serious could be okay that's the kind of feeling i'm getting that's why they got cut off because the king of swords is here and they're like no i'm done this is it not happening anymore now the king of wands and reverse wants to return back because they feel guilty of avoiding something or avoiding a connection or ignoring something now they don't want to do that they're returning back but now you're like you know what no no means no i'm shut down king of cups and reverse is someone emotionally manipulated but i don't see more manipulation i see someone who's hurt and who's shut down a lot of mature people talking here all right clarify the two of wands in reverse for people who are um wondering why i have uh the rider weight um out here another rider weight here because i lost my uh two cards from this deck and i love this deck so much so i had to put in two cards from the other deck i love the borderless deck two of wands in reverse all right it's clarified by the ace of pentacles so someone made a decision to start a new beginning in the past someone wanted to commit so someone started something stable and secure okay someone made a decision a long pending decision uh to start something new something stable something solid something committed clarify the ace of pentacles what is this ace of pentacles in the past what is this ace of pentacles in the past clarify the ace of pentacles yeah but unfortunately uh things didn't work out there wasn't a wish that was fulfilled maybe there was a very disappointing situation or someone was just not happy someone was very dissatisfied the nine of cups in reverse to me is also someone who's emotionally extremely dependent okay they're not emotionally independent so i feel that someone made a decision they started something new and committed but then it i don't think things work out worked out as they did want it to it was not a very satisfying situation Give me one more card for the Nine of Cups in Reverse. Why is the Nine of Cups in Reverse? Give me one more card for the Nine of Cups in Reverse. Yeah, because instead of making the, situ the situation making you happy, it was actually a big fucking burden. It stressed you out. The situation, the, the new start, the new beginning, whatever you had, whatever decision you made, it was actually, it made you so emotionally, it drained you out completely. It emotionally drained you out. It sucked the energy out of you. It didn't make you happy at all. It was not a wish fulfill, a wish fulfillment. Something did not come to fruition, and in fact, and in fact, it became such a big burden to you. We have the ten of wands here. Something was a big burden to you in the past. All right, 
I'm sorry, I had to pause. The kids are around. Um, so, uh, clarify the magician. Why is the magician here as the current situation for Pisces? You're manifesting. Someone's manifesting a brand new start with you. We have the Ace of Wands here. Could be dealing with a fire sign. But this is very, very passionate, okay? The Ace of Wands to me is like brand new. You know, like a clean slate. Like, you know what? Fuck the past, all right? Let's just start new, babe. Something like that. But someone's manifesting a brand new beginning with you, Pisces. This is someone that in the past, things didn't really work out with this person, okay? There was no emotional fulfillment with this person. And it just got you drained and it for, in fact it was a burden but you did start something small okay it was a little like you know the ace of pentacles is like a small seed okay from the universe that you plant okay you nurture it and it has the potential to grow big you did but it didn't really work out exactly the way you wanted it to clarify for the ace of wands clarify for the ace of wands clarify for the ace of wands for pisces clarify for the ace of wands for pisces please what is this ace of wands Yeah, it's going to be something that is going to make you very happy. Not only happy, it's going to bring you a lot of clarity about a situation, okay? The sun can also be something committed, something, um, you know, something very solid, okay? It could be involving kids, kids. it could be marriage. Care for the sun. What is the sun? But someone definitely wants a brand new beginning with you and... It's going to make you very, very happy. Whatever was in the dark, things are going to be clear. Okay, You're going to get a lot of clarity about a situation. Any situation that you were thinking that was not clear to you. Clarify for the sun. Yeah. But you're not stressing about this, bro. I love that, Pisces. I, I feel that, you know. I feel we're not stressing about things anymore. You know what? We're more like, you know what? This is up to the universe. You know what I want, right? It's like we talking to the universe like, you know what, you know what I want, you know what I need, you know what I am craving for, right? I'm leaving this up to you. You make it happen when you want to. And that happens exactly when you stop stressing about it. Someone's sleeping better. I like that, Pisces. I have a very strong feeling, Pisces, that's you, but it could be the cross watcher. And all this is happening and this is because you left someone out in the cold. There was a breakup, separation, no talking, isolation clarify for the five of pentacles why is the five of pentacles influencing the current situation why is the five of pentacles influencing the current situation please clarify for the five of pentacles yeah you left someone out in the cold could be a situation where you felt betrayed and uh, cheated on doesn't always have to be betrayed but this is where you were like extremely extremely hurt about a situation okay and this th this is someone you really really loved okay I feel it's backstabbing. It doesn't have to be, but backstabbing, betrayal. But this is deep. This is overkill, okay? You were, like, done with this situation. Like, what the fuck? Like, enough, all right? But now you're healing from this. Maybe you left this person or you isolated from this person. And um, now you're healing from a situation. You're healing from that heartbreak or healing from whatever. Yeah. You're healing from a situation. Clap for the Ten of Swords in reverse. Clap for the Ten of Swords in reverse, please. Why is the Ten of Swords in reverse here? You're getting over it. See, you're getting over the you're getting over the past betrayal or pain, or someone is. Whoever you left out in the cold, they're healing from a situation. And now they want a brand new beginning in love. All right, Pisces, I love this. Okay, this person not only wants a passionate new beginning with you, but they want a brand new beginning in love. You have the Ace of Wands. You have the Ace of Cups. You have the Ace of Pentacles in the past. What else do you want, Pisces? clarity we'll see if we have the ace of swords coming in but isn't this more than clear whoever you left out in the past they're healing they're healing from a situation and they want a brand new beginning with you your man you're manifesting a brand new slate with them a brand new beginning with them a passionate brand new beginning and that's also happening because you're not stressing about it so you both want the same thing clap at the chariot why is the chariot on pisces mind what is this chariot on Pisces's mind? Clarify for the chariot. Oh my, L listen, hello. Did you just see that? Did you see that? You had the chariot clarified by the chariot. Fuck. When two cards, that doubles the energy. You're so desperate to move towards someone. Or, or this could just be them too. This is two people desperate to move towards each other. You want to travel like, fuck, I need to see you, babe. 
like i need to see you baby like that's that's the energy that i get this person who are you dealing with 100% is living at a distance from you you just want to travel you're like you want nothing doing i'm meeting you the chariot is someone who's like i said he's very focused he's very like you know what i am in control of the situation and i'm going to make this shit happen no one's coming in between me they won't give a shit this is someone who's just if they know what they want they're moving towards it this could be someone who's just like you know what so on their jet and they're outside your house i know we're in quarantine i'm just saying that's the desperate energy i get here clarify the chariot why is the chariot here twice clarify the chariot why is the chariot here twice on pisces's mind clarify the chariot please yeah because they want to walk away from anything that wasn't making them happy okay either you are walking you are very determined to move away from a situation that didn't make you happy or this is someone who you weren't in talking terms with and um they are walking away from the past situation and not really from you we'll see clarify the eight of cups i need to see if the person is walking away from you or the situation clarify the eight of cups what is the eight of cups here yeah okay so <clears throat> seven of cups here this is also that someone has their options open but out here hell no this is not someone who has their options open they're walking away from whatever shit then make them happy now they are looking for ways to approach you how am i going to get to my pisces that's the feeling i get we have two chariots we have the eight of cups and we have the seven of cups all right this is i'm coming towards you all right why because i am because i am i don't care i'm doing this i'm coming this is happening anyhow they're walking away from the past situation whatever happened in the past let it be and now they're looking for ways to approach you this is someone who's like you know what how i'm going to get to pisces i i mean this is 100% someone who's confused they want to choose the best way to walk towards you the 6 of swords in reverse just popped out i didn't ask a question but someone stuck on you okay this is someone who's invested into you they're not being able to uh, move on okay give me give me uh, tell me tell me what is the knight of swords what is the knight of swords here someone's rushing in to communicate their truth could be someone who just quickly quickly comes in and leaves because it's a knight right the knights don't stay clarify the knight of clarify the knight of swords please clarify the knight of swords what is the knight of swords here for? All right. <clears throat> I see someone's rushing in. You know what? You know the kind of feeling I get? Pisces, your mind. Fuck what the world says. I don't give a rat's ass. I am coming towards you, your mind, and we're going to figure this shit out. I'm going to figure a way to make this work out, okay? I thought this is you, Pisces, or this is the person you're dealing with, okay? This is someone who you had a beginning with in the past but things did not really make you happy a wish did not come true it was a burden situation okay could be someone who was inconsistent could be someone non committal too okay because now they want a brand new beginning with you twice twice this person is rushing in to tell you that you know what i want to move forward with you i'm going to make this a success this is someone the 6 of wands is someone who wants success anyhow okay this is someone on a horse public recognition they want to move forward they want success anyhow i can't stress enough i see a lot of determined energy you know like no no not giving up not giving up anymore i've had enough clear for the 6 of wands what is the 6 of wands clear for the 6 of wands yep and now they are very very super focused on this um relationship okay they want to invest into this relationship i can see it two ways someone's rushing in to communicate with you that they want to move forward with you and you're too focused on your work we have the 8 of pentacles here you're focused on your work because you're like doing yourself you're taking care of yourself could be work could be working from home whatever you're doing but you're focused on yourself you're not really focused on this person anymore law of attraction like i said the moment you let your focus go away from what you want that's exactly when it comes in so take it how it resonates but the other way of looking at it is that this person now wants to invest they want to work hard they want to invest they want to uh, invest in this relationship and they're concentrating and focus on focusing on this relationship clear for the eight of pentacles clear for the eight of pentacles why is eight of pentacles here it's it's a very clear cut reading i mean it's it's cool yeah 
whoever this person is they've done a lot of thinking this is the hermit this person could have isolated from you uh, isolation as in withdrawn i mean were anyways isolated this is someone who was withdrawn someone who's done a lot of self introspection someone who's thought a lot about this relationship okay i don't feel this person withdrew from them withdrew from you to make a decision of whether they want to be with you or not i think they withdrew of like what am i doing here okay how am i supposed to move ahead because on their mind or your mind is the seven of cups you could have been drawn from this person okay but this is introspection this is trying to find out how when why why is this happening what do i need to know you know this is someone who asks the questions to themselves which is a good which is a good thing okay you're not talking to this person there's no action happening right now but i don't think you're in communication with this person even if you are it's very very low but i think this is person this is someone who's just withdrawn a lot of withdrawn energy clear for the hermit please clear for the hermit please could be dealing with a virgo clear for the hermit yeah they need to pick and now you need to pick a direction or maybe they need to pick a direction in the past there was a direction that was chosen you've started something new now this time you need to pick a direction or someone's going to pick a direction okay we have the two of wands here the two of wands is basically half and half out okay so this could be you pisces could be you okay whoever's withdrawn is making is going within to make this decision or this is someone who's withdrawn and now you need to make a decision someone needs to pick a choice you have two roads okay this is this is going to have to be a very detached choice okay this but this guy is holding the globe in his hand like he needs to make a very detached choice he, the world is right in front of him he needs to choose which way to go this honestly this is a little stagnant energy okay because this person is still needing to make a choice pick a direction okay they still haven't clear for the temperance <clears throat> clear for the temperance why is the temperance here as the future out uh, as the future for pisces why will pisces experience the temperance coming into the future clear for the temperance yeah you need to have patience because someone's losing hope someone's losing faith in a connection we have the temperance clear for by the star in reverse could be dealing with an aquarius but someone needs to have patience someone's going to have patience but there is someone who's losing faith in a connection okay they can't wait they, they don't have um two of cups in reverse i didn't ask a question it's still flew out there is a disconnection okay there are two people who are not being able to see eye to eye or you're not on the same page as of now <sighs> Clear for the star in reverse. Clear for the star in reverse. Someone thinks it's a hopeless situation. They may be holding on. They may be having patience, but they just from within they feel it's a hopeless situation. Like nothing's happening. Their wish is never going to be fulfilled. Clear for the star in reverse. Clear for the star in reverse. Yeah. Someone's going to feel left out in the cold again. We have the five of pentacles here. We have the five of pentacles. Um, as clarified, there's a lot of lack. A lot of like you know what. loneliness someone just feels lonely 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 could be because someone's not making a decision or someone wants a brand new beginning but there's someone who's not making a decision okay i think you both want the same thing but it's just a lot of indecision indecisiveness mm. clear for the five of pentacles clear for the five of pentacles please clear for the five of pentacles yeah All right, I get this. Now I get this. We have the Queen of Wands in reverse. There is someone here who needs to pick a choice, pick a direction, pick a road. Could be between two people, two situations or whatever, okay? But there is someone who is not taking action. The Queen of Wands in reverse is someone who is not making shit happen. She usually has the go for it vibe, okay? She's passionate, she's optimistic, she knows what she wants and she's a go-getter, okay? Out here, she's laid back, she's letting things happen. like she's not there out there you know like you know what i want this and this is how i'm going to get it that's why someone feels left out probably you know this is someone definitely who's feeling very like like you're not with them on the same page you know like if you want me you got to do something about it right they're very determined but it's like how how am i supposed to make things happen if you're not with me right it takes two to tango but someone's losing passion or someone's just lost their passion they're like you know what uh, uh, i don't know I think we tried this a lot of times. It was just a burden. It just drained me out emotionally and now I I don't know if I want this anymore. And that's why someone's just giving someone the cold shoulder, okay? 
that's why the star is in reverse someone's losing hope in a connection they're late they're staying patient you're going to stay patient but yeah it's just that you're not going to take action clever the queen of wands in reverse clever the queen of wands in reverse <laughs> <laughs> Queen of Wands in reverse is clarified by the King of Wands. Okay, so you you oh my, you know what? Look at this. This is so funny. The overall energy we had the King of Wands in reverse. Okay, this is the King of Wands who is inconsistent. Okay, non-committal, didn't take action. You cut their head off because they were ignoring a situation. They were ignorant. They were trying to escape. They, be, they were being escapist. King of Wands in reverse is also someone who's a coward, okay? Not really facing his fears and not really doing the right thing, okay? Then they return and you're like, fuck you. Sometimes I say bad words. If it offends you, hard left. I said this before. I'm saying it again. Now in the future, all right, now the king wants to be the king, huh? In the future, I think you're going to show a lot of patience. You're going to be like, you, you have faith in the divine timing. You know that things are going to be fated with you. You know that whatever happens, happens for the best. And you're not stressing about it. We already see that you're not stressing about a situation, right? But someone's losing hope because you're not talking. I feel very quiet energy here, okay? Because I don't see a lot of action happening here. You, someone's losing hope in this connection. They feel left out. They feel you're not talking. They feel you've isolated yourself. You're pushing them away because you're not taking action. You're losing passion. You're losing interest. And now the king of wands is like, no, I'm here. Now they're going to take action. Why does this always have to happen? Why does it, you know, it's just that I know what it means that this is how law of attraction works. You let something go that you want the most and then it comes back to you. But it's just that, you know, by the time it comes back to you, you're not interested, you know. The king of wands and the queen of wands, that's a fucking death. But now you're not interested anymore. You've lost the passion and now they want to come in with like something solid. Now they want to give you the stability. I don't know. I don't know, Pisces. If you want them, they're coming. It's you. It's, it's up to you. If you want them, they're, they're coming. That's for sure. All right, Pisces. I love you so much. Love me hard back. And I hope this resonates with you. Please like, share, comment below. I'd love to hear from you. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.